Hi, it's Janie. Welcome back to my channel. And today I have a pretty good sized haul video for you. I um, have a little bit of products that were sent to me for review, um, a Sephora haul, and some products that I purchased from Walmart. So if you're interested in seeing what I have to show you, then just keep on watching. Okay, so um, first of all, I want to kind of give you a little bit of an update on mother-in-law. Um, a few weeks ago, if you don't know, we had a little bit of ice here in Oklahoma and she was letting her dog out and fell down the steps and broke her ankle in like three different places. Um, she had surgery on that and had pins put in on Tuesday and was in the hospital Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Friday afternoon. Um, we transported her to a, um, a nursing home that she's going to be at for about a week for rehabilitation on her ankle. Um, so that is update with her. She did really good through her surgery and um, appears that her ankle is on the end. Um, my father-in-law, the one that was in the wreck back in September and had broke his hip on Friday when I was taking her getting her settled into the um, nursing home facility. My husband called and said he was on his way taking him to the emergency room with a massive headache. He'd been having a really bad headache off and on for a couple weeks and it just finally got to the point where he just couldn't take it any longer. So husband took him to the emergency room, met them there later, they did a CAT scan and it showed some swelling on the brain and at this hospital here in Muskogee they weren't equipped to do an MRI so they transported him to Tulsa to um, St. Francis Hospital which is a pretty good sized hospital and on Saturday they did an MRI and then yesterday while we were there the, all the doctors came in and gave us results from x-rays, MRIs, and he has a massive um, um, mass in his lungs and they feel that the chances of it being cancer is pretty high and um, this has moved to his brain and there are the MRI showed multiple tumors in the brain. So today being Monday, they are going to go in and do a biopsy of the mass in his lungs and um, find out what kind of cells it is and go from there as far as what kind of treatment and just that and the other. So we have had a busy two weeks, definitely. Um, and it looks like um, things are not going to get better for a while. So if my videos are a little bit hit and miss or a little sporadic because I do like to upload on Monday, Tuesdays, and Thursdays, you may be seeing um, some gaps in those videos. And that is, that is why, is because we just have all this other going on with the family. So anyway, but I wanted to take a break from all of that and sit here and talk about makeup for a while. Um, definitely need, need a little, little girl time with you guys. So anyway, um, I think what I'm going to start with is going to be the products that I received, um, for PR from Octoly and in, by no means is my opinion um, altered because I received the products for review. And the only um, stipulations with Octoly is that um, you post your videos and do the review of the video in a timely manner. They do have a time frame. So I want to make sure I um, fulfill my obligations by getting these products out there to show to you and um, let you know what I think of them and so we're going to get started with that okay the first product I want to um, show you and talk to you about is from Becca and this is the first light priming filter um, it is a primer that you would use all over the face before makeup and it is in this uh, really pretty um, violet 
purpley color that's supposed to help to really brighten the complexion. It has little light refractors in there and helps to brighten the skin. It's a very thin consistency. It's almost like a serum-like consistency. So you can see it just smooths out really pretty. And look, oh, it is so pretty. Um, has a little bit of a scent, but not too bad. And yeah, so that is that product. And I've been using it for a week now, I think, and have really been enjoying it. I like the fact that it's a thinner consistency. And when I put it on, you can really see the brightening. It is a little bit moisturizing. So if you have dry skin, this would be really good for dry skin. The next product that I have is also from Becca, and this is the Under Eye Brightening Corrector. And it's in this little pot here, and it looks like this here. This is a very creamy and emollient <laughs> product. And if you have dry under eyes like I do, you are going to really like this. I have been very much enjoying it. It doesn't take very much not a little bit goes a long way and I just smooth it on underneath the eyes. It has um, light refractors in it also to kind of help to brighten the under eye. Um, it's really good to put on underneath concealer. I haven't been doing a whole lot of concealer here lately. I've just been mainly using this um, because I just haven't found a concealer yet that hasn't been creasing. Now this I have not had any problems with it creasing. I like the way that it makes the under eye feel um, and look very moisturized. I like that kind of look. Now if I could just find something to do get rid of these um, the puffy bags my luggage underneath my eyes here um, and of course here lately I haven't been in a lot of sleep so they're very really shine through but anyway so I did get that from Becca and have been enjoying using that. Okay, the next product I wanna to talk to you about from Octoly is from the brand number seven, and this is an under eye hydrogel moisturizing pack. Um, this is for instant results, for revitalizing, powerful radiance boost for bright and awake looking eyes. There's five in a box and it's around $15 is the price point on those. And they have vitamin C in them, vitamin E, and um, they also kind of provide like a little cooling airless layer on the skin. I'm trying to get this all back together. But I wanted to show you how they were packaged because I used one of these the other night, but they came in this little um, container here, first of all, so they were very well preserved, so they're not going to dry out. They also had all these backings on them. Each one had... The next product that I have to share with you is also another product from Becca. Becca was very generous and um, kind to me and selected to <laughs> let me... Um, selected me to receive some of these products but anyway this guy is a new product that they've come out with and that's going to be so glowy you're probably not going to be able to see it but anyway it's the shimmering skin perfecter pressed in gradient glow and what this has it has five of their best sellers all in one compact you can use each color um, on its own um, granted once you see this you would have to have a small brush to do that, or you can swirl them together to create a beautiful customized um, highlight. I do have it on and I kind of concentrated on the center here with mine um, to get my highlight. But anyway, the highlights that it has in here is um, bronzed amber, moonstone, opal, rose gold and topaz and it's the shimmery skin perfector pressed highlighter and it is just so pretty so pretty i mean there's it on my finger and i just swirl like i did i just swirled in the center here because those are the colors that i like and let me put those on and there it is on my hand oh, 
so pretty, so pretty. So definitely worth um, checking out if you like the um, Becca pressed highlight highlighters. Um, you can get all the colors together. You can use them separately. You're just going to have to have a small brush <laughs> to do that. But um, I think you could probably get a small fan brush in there. But definitely you can, it can be done because I am able to swatch all of the colors individually. So there they are on my fingers. So anyway, so I did get that from Becca. So thank you very much to Becca for that. And that is really pretty. And I think this was is a new item that is just getting ready to launch. Let me see if it tells me here if it's launched yet. I don't remember. Don't know. But anyway, um, you can look on um, Sephora's website. There will be a link in the description box for all the products that I received from Octoly. Um, there will be links for those products. So, and this is going to retail for $38. Okay, and the next product I want to talk to you about from Octoly is from the brand number seven. And this is an under eye hydrogel moisturizing pack. Um, this is for instant results, for revitalizing, powerful radiance boost for bright and awake looking eyes. There's five in a box and it's around $15 is the price point on those. And they have vitamin C in them, vitamin E, and um, they also kind of provide like a little cooling airless layer on the skin. I'm trying to get this all back together, but I wanted to show you how they were packaged because I used one of these the other night, but they came in this little um, container here, first of all, so they were very well preserved, so they're not going to dry out. They also had all these backings on them. Each one had back and then a little um, tissue back on it also to help keep the moisture or the, the serum intact so they didn't dry out. So they were very nice and very refreshing. And I really did like them. I've got four more to use. So I'm going to be using those the next couple weeks. I definitely need them. With everything that's going on right now, I definitely need some under eye patches for sure. So I did get those from um, Octoly and for number seven the brand number seven i think you can get this brand at target and at um ulta so anyway so the next product okay so now let's move on to some products that i um, purchased at walmart and um i kind of have started getting back into wearing um some eyelashes and um I wanted to try some different ones. I actually went to Walmart because there was a, a style from Revlon that I really liked. And the Walmart that I went to, they didn't have the Revlon. So I ended up purchasing these two packages of lashes. One is the Ardell Natural Eye Lifting Effect, um, number 120. And that looks like this here. I will definitely have to to trim those. I always have to trim my um, my lashes for sure. And the way I like to trim them is I like to take just a small portion off of each side. And then the other one I have is from Salon Perfect, and this is the Go Glam Multi Pack, um, the Demi Wispies, and. Does it have a number? No, nope. it just says the Glow, Glow Glam Multi-Pack. And I did get both of these packages at Walmart. And then the next product that I got at Walmart, it's actually two things, but it's the same. It's in two different colors. And it's this Airspun um, powder from Cody, isn't it? I mean, this has been around since, it says here, since 1935. And I've heard people talk about this a lot of times, um, off and on. I um, thought I would give it a try, and I couldn't make up my mind which color I wanted. So I ended up getting the Translucent Extra Coverage, which is this one here. And it is, what's 
this one the pink I think this is the pink color yeah this is a little bit of the pink color and then I also got naturally neutral in here and what I've been doing is I've been mixing the colors mixing them together in my lid and then I've been using them to um, do an all-over set of my foundation oh my gosh I love this I and I'm, I'm thinking I really like it even better than my $60 Chanel powder I think it was $60 it might have even been more than that but yes I am very much enjoying that I like the finish of it um, I haven't noticed it settling in any of my fine lines and wrinkles that I have on my face um, and it's just really really pretty it's a very it's a beautiful finish why have I not used this before the only thing I will say though um, is it does have talc so if you don't want something with talc you're not gonna like this and it has fragrance it's very heavily fragranced I don't mind it because I like the smell of it it's kind of like a soft powdery scent which I think is beautiful I love that smell but if you do not like scents on your face um, you're you're not going to like this because you can definitely smell it and you can definitely smell it throughout the day it's not one of those products or those scents that kind of have a, a tendency to evaporate over the course of the day no you're going to smell this quite a bit so anyway okay so now i'm going to um move on over into some Avon. Annie, she sells Avon, and so I ordered this off of her her online store, and I will um, link her, I'll link a video somewhere up there, an iCard of one of her Avon videos so that you can go watch. I will also put in the description box her um, Avon web store link to that so that if you want to order from her that you can but anyway she was showing in one of her videos there's um, a campaign I forget what campaign this was six maybe where they were having a big sale and um, here lately I've been really into bag charms and they had a bag charm that was on clearance that looks like this it says love and um, when she showed it in the book i knew i needed to get get it and this one has a really big um ring here so you could actually i start to say you could actually use it for keys but i don't know if it would your key would if it would fit through your key hmm. anyway just so cute and Fell in love with that it was like five dollars so it was very inexpensive and then they had these pack of um, t-shirts also on the sale page I think these were twenty dollars let me see if I can find what they are were called it's a four pack of versatile tees and I got mine in a size large which is a 14 16 and it is I looked, <clears throat> but I don't remember what the material is. Oh, like I'm going to be able to see that. 90%, oh, not 90%, 60% cotton and 40% polyester. It was a four pack. I have the blue one, and then it had this beautiful coral in it this is the main reason why I got it was for this color here I love this color it's gonna be so pretty for spring and then it had a solid um, navy blue and then a solid cream color right there and they also have the um, gosh I don't know what this is called but it's it's kind of like a rounded hem and a little bit um, vented. Well, it's not really vented. How do I, I don't know how you want to say that. But you can see it's kind of scooped up. Anyway, this is my first day wearing it. And so far it's very comfortable. It fit well. Um, 
So yeah, I just wanted to wear the blue with my um, navy blue sweater because it is a little bit chilly out this morning, but it's supposed to get in like the mid 60s by this afternoon and no rain today. We've had massive rain and floods and everything else the last couple weeks. So it's kind of nice to have a little bit of a dry spell. So the next product that I want to talk to you about or show you is the products that I ordered off of Sephora. And I have a couple of products and then I have a bunch of point perks and different things. So I have a whole box full of stuff, but I actually only ordered two things. And the first one is from Saturday Skin. It's the Wide Awake Brightening Eye Cream. And um, it looks like this in this pump. And I got this to use of the morning as a eye cream. And I'm going to be doing a dedicated video specifically on the products that I have from Saturday Skin and how I incorporate them into my morning skincare routine. So I was needing an eye cream from this brand that I wanted to try because this is a very, very nice brand, a Korean brand that is sold at Sephora. So I did get that. I also got a mask from Saturday Skin and it's the Quench. So I ordered that. So I'm gonna be giving that a try in that video. So you make sure you're subscribed and that you have clicked on the little bell icon so that you will get a notification when I get that video up. And then I did get a 500 point perk, and this is for the Josie Marion Juicy Glowing Argan Treats. And this was actually a pretty decent 500 point perk. And you could actually do, because there's a lipstick in there, there was a lipstick. And there's a little thing of argan oil. There's a mask. And what was this other product? This was the um, da, 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 uh, moisturizer. So do a little mini facial there. And I like having those little argan oils. I don't need a big one because I don't use it all the time, but I do like to have it handy or when I do decide that I want to use one. Um, this was a 100 point perk, and this is the Pure Grace in um, Nude Rose. I like the initial smell of it, but as it starts to dry down, I don't really care for it. So I'm glad I got a good size sample to try instead of going out and purchasing the full, the full thing. Another point perk that I um, got was the Laura Mercier Foundation Primer in Radiance. Another 100 point perk. This one I was disappointed in. This is the Makeup Forever Artist Color Eyeshadow. The way it looked on the website that it was going to be bigger, but it is just this little bitty spot of eyeshadow right there. So kind of disappointing on that but especially when you consider how much money you spent to get 100 points at Sephora <laughs> so, yeah anyway okay um oh yeah this was another 100 point purse purse perk and it's the fresh rose face mask I have another video um planning on doing and that is the benefit of using rose in your skincare and I wanted to have that to be able to show you and talk about and then some samples I did get and I actually got the samples that I um, selected did I no I did not because I did not select this I started to say I got all the samples I selected but anyway I got the Marjo I think that's how you say it. Nourishing cleansing cream and deep treatment butter for the hair. Got that little packet. This is the one I don't think I ordered and it's the Drunk Elephant 
TLC Frambruce Glycolic Night Serum. And then the Corez Cores um, Greek Yogurt Foaming Cream Cleanser. There, I, I thought Sephora quit carrying this, this brand. Are they coming back with it? Maybe it was just the, the, um, the face, the, the makeup in that line. I don't know. Anyway, and then this little guy here was one of those um, products that you put in a code. If you spent, this was little guy was one of those products that you um, put in a code and then you can get a free product. Like you put it, you spend so much money, you can get a, a free product. And this is the La Mer, the moisturizing soft cream. Deeply nourishes for glowing radiance with a luminous finish. It's in this cute little baby La Mer product. So, as you can see, I'm really trying to find products that are going to help my skin be radiant and glowy. Um, especially in the winter time when you get it so dry. And, ugh. and plus I've been using um, some retinol. And that has a tendency to really dry you out. So, yeah, that's really nice. I don't think you'll be able to see anything right there. So... So anyway, um, I think that is it. Yes, that is it for this big, massive haul. I hope that you stuck around with me to the very end and um, will give me a thumbs up and subscribe and click on that bell icon. And I will talk to you in the next video. Thank you so much and have a great day. Bye.